This intersection of music and activism and the energy is all focused in the right place. There's 60,000 people on the Great Lawn in Central Park watching these incredible bands. There's all these people watching around the world that's being live streamed to a dozen different places. And all of it is for the purpose of ending global poverty through these incredible organizations, hundreds of millions of dollars being raised. This is like my fantasy. I, I mean, I can't even believe it's real. I was giving an award to Ermi Basu, who runs an incredible organization called New Light in Calcutta, India, which is helping young women and uh, preventing them from entering into the sex slave trade. And she runs schools, and she's just an incredible leader uh, in the fight against poverty. And so I got to give her an award, and then I got to present uh, two incredible people who run an organization called Shining Hope for Communities, which is in Kenya. And uh, Jessica and Kennedy Odede are incredible people. This school that they run in Kibera Slum in Nairobi is a girls' school. It's the most extraordinary elementary school I've ever seen. They also run uh, an AIDS program, a computer lab, a water treatment tower, um, a library, a community center. I mean, it goes on and on. So all of these people are mingling with people who just love music and communities. So. That's what's happening, and I'm just lucky to be here. I wish I could go to some of the debates. That would be wonderful. Um, I will be following them. I'm really interested to see what happens when each candidate is really pressed on policy. I uh, have made no secret about my support for Barack Obama uh, and Joe Biden, and I'm confident that once people see the debates, there will be no question as to who really has a plan uh, for fixing the economy, for getting us out of this slum, for creating jobs, for protecting women's rights, for protecting immigrants' rights, the list goes on and on. But um, even though I personally have made my choice, I always tune into the debates because uh, that's part of democracy and it's one of the most important parts of the process. So I encourage people to check them out.